You can also import out existing audio recorded files in Audiate and edit them like any other narrations. So I'm going to go around into file and then I'm going to click on import audio right here. And on my desktop, I have a pre-recorded audio in M4A format. So unlike exporting, the supported formats for importing are WAVE MP3, M4A, MP4. So four formats are supported. So I can simply open that out and it transcribes the audio right here. So this is going to take a while. So I'm just going to fast forward this part. And our transcribing process has uh, it is over. So here it says this is an audio recorded clip with is. Okay, so there's something wrong with this. So we can just play out and hear out what it says. This is an audio recorded clip, which is, which is. So this is which. So right click. There you go. There's which right here. Clip, which is recorded, which is recorded. So combine both of these right here. Combine into custom word recorded just like that all right so now just play around it's recorded in another another audio okay so this is something that it really messed up so another all right another another audio recording application that i'm going to bring and import into audiate into audiate all right so there you go i can simply combine the word into audiate right over here so there you go. I'm just going to uh, delete out these gaps right here and let's see how that sounds now. So I can, I just edited that out. This is an audio recorded clip, which is recorded in another audio recording application that I'm going to bring and import into Audiate. So much more better as you can see right there. So that is how you import out audio and work with it just like that. But it's not just uh, narrations that you can import. Of course, you can bring in music and edit them as well, but you don't have a very good control over the music. But let's just try that out anyway. So I'm just going to go to file right here. Let's import out the audio. Maybe I have some on my Dropbox right here. Like there's like eight, uh, yeah, anniversary music right here. So let me just open this up. So it does try to transcribe the audio, but let's see what happens right here. So I'm just going to fast forward the process. And now the audio has been imported. But you can see right here that it has been imported as a silence right here. Of course, it detected no words right here. Sometimes it's funny that it does detect some words. So let me just open that out in the waveform. And here you can just uh, cut out portions that you don't want. So let's just play out and hear out how it sounds like. So let's say you don't want this one right here. I can just go over here, delete this part out right here. And now you don't have the beginning anymore. Okay, so you don't want any part right here. You can just go around and delete off the portions. I'm just going to zoom out right here. Let's say, for example, till around just like this. So let's just go around and play this out. Okay, so let's say from here, I don't want it. Okay, so I'm just going to select and drag out all till the end right here so let's just go around right here and then what i can do is delete the things out and there you go we have our uh, audio clip right here so i can just delete this portion out as well just like that and then i have it till till here so i can just export it out as any other audio right here so export the audio and then go around i'm just going to go around onto my desktop and say uh like snipped audio clip just like this and then i'm going to hit save and then it'll export out the music just like this of course audiate is not meant uh, for editing music or any other audio clips just like that but if you don't have no other option then you can see that you can also use it to actually snip out music portions and other audio clips as you like and that is how you can import out audio and work with it inside of Audiate. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.